Today I will show you how to edit cars in Lightroom. So this is how the image should look after we finish editing it. Let's get started. So the first thing I like to do in Lightroom is go down to Lens Correction. We check the box here to enable it and we choose the camera which we took the picture in. And make sure you get the lens right as well. So now, I like to align my image. I click the box here, and then I click the ruler here next to angle. So since our car is symmetrical, I like to choose two points that are the same on both sides. So let's just choose here. And we'll click enter. So now I like to first lower the exposure by quite a bit and raise the contrast up a little bit. Now we can see that the highlights is a bit strong here. So we can lower the highlights. And for my car pictures, I like to raise the shadows by a lot. This this will um, give us more detail. And for white and black, I tend to leave it alone. And now clarity, I generally raise it by roughly 40. And clarity is very important for car pictures. As you can see to the difference, it helps bring out the lights um, and the midtones. So since our car is kind of sober, there's not there's no real like really point to increase vibrance. So I just leave it alone here. I decrease the saturation by roughly 10. And now we move on to color saturation. So since we're gonna crop it out and edit it in Photoshop eventually, we don't really need any of the colors in the background. We want to make our editing life a lot easier, right? So I would decrease the greens to the yellows by almost all of it. And here you can see some purple, magenta, and red. So I would lower the saturation to for all of them. And orange. So now as you can see here, the blue, I kind of want more of it. So I raise the saturation up a tiny bit. And now we go back up and we can increase the exposure again to the way we want. I think this is good. And now I play with the temperature. Depending on how you want to edit the picture, you might want a warmer look or a colder look. And there we have it. That's how I edit cars in Lightroom. And after this, we can just import this picture into Photoshop, crop it, and do car image manipulation. And this is the, now we can compare with the before. A huge difference. Alright, so thank you for watching this video and if you liked it please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe. Bye!